Brandon Jones had a solid rookie season for the Miami Dolphins, and competition for places can help him continue to develop his game. Miami Dolphins head coach Brian Flores is keen on having a strong secondary, and the team's drafting and free agency signings have worked hard to build a unit he can work with. Part of that process was drafting former Texas Longhorns safety Brandon Jones in the third round, 70th overall, of the 2020 draft, with the Nacogdoches, Texas native putting in some solid numbers during his debut season at the professional level. Jones played in all 16 games during the 2020 season, but started in just four of them, putting up a team fourth best 62 combined tackle, 41 solo, with three tackles for a loss, a pass defense, a forced fumble, a sack and a QB hit. He continued his physical style of play that he had demonstrated at the University of Texas and entered the 2021 offseason likely expecting to compete for a starting role with the Dolphins. After the 2021 draft came and went, the Dolphins added yet more competition at the free safety position in the form of Javon Holland out of the University of Oregon, being selected in the second round, 36th overall. Being chosen so high in the draft, Holland projects to be a starter in the NFL and potentially could claim the starting free safety job with the Miami Dolphins right out of the gates, unless Jones is able to push himself to compete even harder and win the coaching staff over. Having competition for places is a healthy thing in the NFL, with players that could potentially claim starting jobs needing to step up their efforts and performances to ensure that happens rather than losing out to someone new entering the picture. For the Dolphins, Holland could be an ideal starting player for them but so could Jones if he is able to build on his rookie performances. While Jones regularly plays at free safety, his style of play may be better suited to the strong safety role or even at nickel cornerback in some packages, meaning that Jones certainly has plenty of value to the organization, but he will need to keep pushing himself if he hopes to earn reps and snaps come the regular season. Losing his place to Holland would not come as a surprise, but having the rookie around should see the Dolphins benefit from a motivated and determined Jones, who will be working to stay relevant within the organization. Having a competition for the starting role ensures no complacency, including from Holland who will be keen to make an impact at the NFL level from the get-go. Having two motivated players pushing each other to be better, with Jones having already tasted what the NFL is and what he is capable of already, should benefit the Dolphins in terms of on-field performances and, ultimately, results. For Brandon Jones, it will be an opportunity to live up to the potential that was initially expected of him with the Longhorns and push himself to be the very best NFL player he can, especially with such a secondary-focused head coach in Flores.